मेहंदी लगा के रखना डोली सजा के रखना with uh, various roles um, from uh, a guy from India, there's um, a Bollywood wannabe, a little gangster lady in it. There's um, l- um, really sweet characters as well as like, a variety of characters. And it's all put together and it's all about um, a little story about um, kids going on, to, on a little trip, basically. In school was when we went to visit Big Ben and Polly put his clock for by an hour just because she wanted to have a lunch early. Yeah, but I was hungry. We were on the front page of every national newspaper, guys. Thanks to Polly, the stock market crashed, and all of London's workers went home uh, early. The character that I play, his name's uh, Shylock, and um, basically I got it uh, because I was I was actually a shadow for another character, but I was promoted to another character, um, and it was supposed to be a female character, but they changed it to a guy's character, so. Uh, they said, "Yeah, we're going to play this. Ca- we're going to use this character. His name is Shylock, and Shylock. He's basically very. He's a very dopey person, but he's actually quite intelligent. Um, he has certain character traits that you know. You never. You're not sure like where he's going to go with things. He's always dope. You don't know what he's thinking. You know. He's he's kind of a dark individual. You don't understand him really. So, it takes a little bit of time to know him to get his character. Yeah. You know that we've been banned from everywhere. Remember what happened last time when Rajni Khan. Hey, just." Raj. <laughs> when Raj went to the Bollywood film shoot and stole Salman Khan's outfit and the school had to raise the bail money to get you out of the police station? I was only trying it on and it would come off because it was too well, dark. at first I was a bit nervous because, you know, it was my first production and everything. But, you know, once we got into the musical, it was fun. The audience has been great. You know, we've got We've been there, we've been working as hard as possible, all this bhangra music, learning different types of music, you know, folk and everything. It's just been really good and it's been a really good experience working with all the other acting students as well as all the dancers as well. So it's been a good opportunity to do this. Boss! Boss! What? What are you talking about, Gunshan? Look, Gunshan, it's Polly. If you don't pull yourself together, curry boy, you're gonna get the bull at the end of my foot. Um, I play Gina, who's basically um, a daughter of Andwar Don, and um, she seems really feisty and stuff. But she says she keeps herself to herself. But she doesn't like people coming into her space too much. How does she like going to show me little feet? Um, basically, she like uh, her introduction. For example, she comes in. She's very. You know, I feel like when she comes in, you can really tell a lot about her. She walks in, like, you know, marching on, and she's got, like, you know, really, like, serious face in her. She's a really confident character. She's very, like, you know, it's just me kind of thing. She knows what she needs to do, and she does it. I feel the audience has loved it. The reviews are absolutely brilliant. The press has, um, some of the journalists have said um, they've been writing reviews, uh, theatre reviews, for about four years and they've never seen anything like it. They absolutely thoroughly enjoyed it and they would recommend it to everyone. <laughs> so these kinds of um, statements and quotes and feedback really do tend to encourage and support people like us and the artists.